Hey Pete, what's up? Hey Doug, what's up? I'm sure things have been pretty crazy with you. Things have been crazy over here uh, lately with all the stuff that's been going on in the country. So, you know, all this stuff that everyone's having to deal with. Um, I just wanted to give you an update and kind of give you a proposition here. Uh, so for my update, uh, one of the first things is, is I switched jobs and I'm now doing technology uh, integration specialist for a school district. So um, all the stuff that I've been working on totally paid off and now that's what I get to do. Um, I do uh, really, really miss all my students, like a lot. Uh, that's the part that kind of sucks right now. Um, which wouldn't have been so bad except for um, we all switched to distance learning so that kind of hindered the idea of being able to go and visit all my classrooms um, and kind of see everybody so that's been really hard for me um, but uh, yeah they're gonna be moving on to the next grade level or the next school so I still won't be able to see them so that's kind of frustrating um, but I'm happy with the position that I'm in uh, the cool thing is this has allowed me to be really creative in a lot of different ways that I haven't been able to be before. I'm able to not just try out things in my own classroom, I'm able to uh, kind of have an idea and then go try it out in a bunch of different classrooms, which is really unique because I'm going to be allowed to not just um, make my own classroom better, which I've been trying to do over the last few years, uh, but I, I'm going to be able to reach more classrooms, which means that I'll be able to reach more students which um, I think is going to be really awesome um, in the next year to come. Uh, we have set up our business. I'm super excited about that. Penny Dukes uh, Media. Um, we have, what have we done? Um, we've done a lot. We've done some business. We've made enough money to buy some stuff to kind of pretty much finish phase one. Um, we still have some work to go with, you know, social media, finishing our website, uh, getting some documents out there like contracts and a few other things. Uh, if you're wondering why I'm looking over, it's because um, I have all my stuff written right over there. Um, I'm super excited to get going once more. All of this social distancing stuff is is over um, to get back out there so we can start doing some more gigs and, and doing some of the stuff that we really love doing. Um, I think we have something good going on. Um, like I said, we're done with pretty much with phase one. I uh, I still want to test out before we move on to phase two, um, with some flash, uh, flash photography. Um, I have like a two flash setup, but one is going to be on the camera itself. So I really want to mess with that and test those things out before uh, we really move on because that's pretty much one of the last things we need to buy uh, for phase one. Be, and then phase two, we can start getting you a nicer camera with some different lenses and stuff like that. Um, and getting our lav mics and things. So I'm really excited because that's going to allow us to start doing uh, bigger projects with uh, higher paying clients, which I'm super excited about because we do have uh, that one client already. That's going to be nice to be able to um, go visit their place uh, and actually start working on all the things that we set up with them. So that one will be actually pretty good. That's what's up as well. Um, besides getting healthy, and we always talk about that, uh, I wanted to mention an idea I had. Um, I really love computers and talking about computers and looking at computer parts and making computers look, you know, just look so cool. And you love building things. Um, so I'd like to actually combine uh, those two ideas into kind of um, a, a hobby. Um, so what I want to do as a side project for us is uh, build custom computer accessories like cases that just look insanely cool you know just like you know they're not necessarily you have to have them like that but they just look so cool that if you got money to burn that's what you would do um, I want to start trying to make some of that myself uh, and I know you've got a lot of those skills and it gives us a reason to hang out some more um, and we would do a, a video about it you get amazing b-roll and we'd set up kind of like a like a set with nice lighting and a nice background and then we would talk about it uh, because you know once you make it you gotta talk about it and that's the part I want to do is you know look at cool tech make cool tech and then talk about cool tech um, and then we put it on my gaming YouTube channel uh, we get enough buzz on it or whatever uh, we can get commissions uh, maybe even partnerships I think that'd be really fun 
uh, to kind of get some of that stuff in. Uh, I've seen stuff where you don't necessarily get to keep the cool stuff that you partner with, but you just get to play with it and test it out, and that's really the fun of it, you know, is you don't have to have it, you just got to be able to play with it, and that's what that, I think that would be so fun to do, and then talk with other people who also really love that as well. Um, there's a lot of people in my neighborhood, a lot of the guys, they're very, you know, drink beer, talk about cars and stuff like that, and um, one, I have a gluten allergy, so I can't drink beer, <laughs> and two, just cars just aren't my thing, um, you know, so I really don't have that anybody to talk to like that uh, kind of here in this area. Uh, so being able to spread out and talk to people like that, like my brother-in-law who kind of got me into all this stuff. Um, and that would allow us to, um, you know, just be fun, working on fun projects together, uh, mix our nerd tech with uh, video skills, and uh, just, you know, get out there and, you know, have fun, you know. Uh, so what do you say? Uh, you want to help do all this stuff, build things, and, you know, work on this channel with me? That's my question to you. Would you want to do projects like that just for fun? You know, not, it doesn't have to be any pressure. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't have to be successful. It's just, hey, do you want to build cool things with me? Because I know you do that with your, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, your 3D printing machine. Um, you know, but we could come up with lots of cool ways to, to build nerd stuff together, you know, and, uh, have fun with that, and if something big happens with it, it does, if it doesn't, it doesn't matter, just because it was fun. Um, that's all I had, that's all I wanted to chat about, just doing hobby activities, uh, that'd be fun, um, there's more to it than that, uh, but that's kind of the basic version of it, um, I'll be the face, and we can just jack around building fun things while videoing all of it. Uh, one day, if people like what we make and think it's fun too, they'll join in the conversation and allow us to continue, you know, a fun nerd hobby uh, that, you know, we both kind of like to do. So, alright. That's what's up.